Maniacs, this is Hulk of X Maniac, and welcome back to Resident Evil Village. Now, this is going to be the last episode of the series. Um, I've just got to go and see Miranda and then see what's going to happen after that. So, here we go. Out of my way. Gotta keep going. Ah, oh, little Eva, my beautiful daughter. Come to me. Eva, is that you? Uh, excuse me, but that's Rose. What? <laughs> My power is leaving me. Rose! <sighs> Miranda! Interesting. Your body certainly isn't normal. Give Rose to me. Now! You will see. Once I kill you properly, every- Get her now! Let go! I've spent a lifetime creating this moment. And you try to take it away from me. Provide her with truth. So now you can die peacefully and permanently. I'm not letting you get away. Here I come. Please, Mr. Winters, stop struggling. I shall finish. Understand 
How can you deny me? Why the hell can't you realize Rose is my goddamn kid, not yours? I shall put you to rest. God damn it, come on. I've never seen a human live without his heart. Are you sure you're not? The Megamycete saved me from the pits of despair. It granted me this splendor. Right. All it's done is drive you nuts. <laughs> Such fight time. Now, Mr. Winters, I think it's time you left things in my hands. Oh, rest now. The hell I will! I will take back my daughter! <laughs> die, die, die! I understand your feelings, Mr. Winters. Truly. But this is... If I combine Rose with a Megamycet, my daughter will be made manifest at last! I've waited a century. A century! All for this day! <laughs> Let me out the way. Think the problem might be you, Miranda? Mm. You're not capable of real love. I will take back my daughter! Die, 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 die! Die. Uh -oh. <laughs> Ah. 
Ow. This is... Your life is over, Mr. Wiggins. Why do you stop? I'll take wonderful care, little Rose. No! Oh, God. Oh, she takes some beating, her like. You still stop. My wish will come. How about this? Oh! This is how you end the years. To ensure I never see your face Not your dollar. She's mad. It falls, Rose. Ethan! 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 Come on, Ethan. Come on, Ethan, wake up! Oh no. Chris. Ethan. He did it. It's finished. I think we've finished each other. Ethan. We gotta move. Keep moving, Ethan. There's a bomb in that thing that'll blow this whole village sky high. Hey, look at me. When I hit this trigger, we can't be anywhere near it. Ah, damn it. Mia's waiting for you. She's alive, you hear me? Alive. Mia. I'm so sorry. I love you. Keep Rose safe. Hey, hey. Hey. <laughs> You tell yourself. Oh, come on, it's not that much further. Watch over her. Teach her to be strong. God damn. Goodbye, Rosemary. Ethan.
Go. Go, take us up now. Get moving. We have to get clear. No! We can't go! Not without my husband! Mia, sit down and strap in. Not before you tell me where Ethan is. I know he wouldn't abandon us. Tell me what's going on. Where? down. Where is he? Chris, what have you done? He's gone. I tried. He stayed so we could all escape. I'm sorry. Captain, you need to see this. BSAA didn't send soldiers. This is a bioweapon. The hell were they thinking? Orders, Captain. Pick up the rest of the squad. Plot a course for BSAA Europe HQ. Someone's got to pay. Wow. Wow. Well. And that is it, everyone. I, <laughs> I can honestly say that that would probably have to be, to me, one of the best... Resident Evil games ever. The storyline was so good. It it just had every, everything. It, it it felt it felt like it was number four as well, where you could buy the guns and stuff like that. Where you could buy the guns and and all that lot. And just wow that was just really good it was a really good storyline I, I found it as much as I loved uh, number seven I, f I feel like they did a lot better with a lot better with the storyline with that it was fun that was just fantastic it'd be I really do hope that they do and do nine in that sort of same format the thing what they did with Chris and that was really good as well. That was brilliant, absolutely brilliant. And um, but yeah, I, I just don't know what else to say really about the game. The game was that was just absolutely brilliant, just so 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 good. Um, yeah, like everything about it, you know, like. The lighting effects of it all was good, and as well, there was a few. There was a few little things about the game as well. There was a few little silly little things about the game, which was a bit over the top, and it was a, a little bit like a little bit laughable, which you know if. I just did. I just found a few Gives things quite laughable the about the game. She snarled. So more in turn is due. In a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. Her parents, though, had searched all day and at last arrived. With rampant rage, father fought the witch, while mother's loving touch shattered the dark enchantment. But the witch was strong, and father yelled, Save our daughter! So mother bore their child to safety as the forest was consumed. 
Even now, the burnt forest is a grim reminder of father's sacrifice. To this day, any child who stares too long into the charred wasteland will be haunted by nightmares of getting lost while picking berries. boy will be able to touch the moon? Nobody can touch the moon. It's too far away. Wait, what if he has a rocket ship? Uh, okay. Then he can touch it, but it'd be very, very cold. You were being silly. I don't <laughs> think the moon feels like it. You think it does, <laughs> but it's... Hey, Dad. Happy birthday. Sorry I missed last week. I have a lot of tests coming up. You know how it is. Talk of the goddamn devil. Duty calls. I love you. Yeah, I found her. Where else? The day of all days. <clears throat> we have a situation. You're needed, <laughs> Evelyn. Don't you ever call me that again. Whoa, whoa, it's just a joke, Rose. I can show you things even Chris doesn't know I can do. <sighs> we have a clear shot. Stand down. I can handle it. Way to keep it together, Rose. You're a lot like him, you know. I know. And that is it. That is the end of Ethan's story. And what a story it, it was. So, that is the end of Resident Evil Village. Uh, thank you very, very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it as much as I have. I am just going to say, if you haven't played this game, go and play it. Because I've enjoyed every second of it. It's been absolutely brilliant. Um, I'm a bit curious on what's happened there at the, at, at the end. I wonder who stopped it. I wonder who it was at the end there. That's... That's a bit of a question mark there. But I think people will uh, have the theories and stuff like that about it. But anyways, uh, yeah, just go and get this game. Go and play it. Just, play, just play, play this game. It's probably one, one of the best ones I would properly say. I got really into it. I had a lot of jump scares in certain places like the doll's house was just that 
I was really scared at, at, at the doll's house. I'm not a big massive fan of dolls and stuff like that anyways, but it, it put me on edge. And and yeah, and everything else of it was, was really good. Um, uh, so, literally, without further ado, uh, thank you very, very much for watching. Really do appreciate it. Uh, there'll be a lot more videos coming up soon or later. Um, but anyways, without further ado, if you liked the video, like and subscribe to the channel. And this is Hulk of X Maniac. Over and out.